Hey, boys and girls. It's time for Uncle Jay Explains the News. Now here's the guy who helps little minds understand big news stories, Uncle Jay. Hi, boys and girls. Well, it's February, and a lot of very important news happens in February. Although a lot of very unimportant, stupid stuff happens, too. Which is why Uncle Jay's news word for this week is transitory. Transitory means temporary. Brief, uh, kind of like your attention span if you skip that trip to the nurse after third period. A lot of February news is transitory, like Groundhog Day. The whole world stops in one place for five minutes, and that's it. And then comes Super Bowl Sunday. The whole world stops in one place for five hours, and that's it. Uh, uh, Tom Petty this year is wearing Janet Jackson's outfit for the halftime show. That contract negotiation probably took a while. And then that's over. And then comes Tuesday, and then everything really does come to a complete stop for the entire day. This used to be called Super Tuesday when about eight states had their presidential primaries. But now it's known as Super Awesome Fragile List Stupenda Palooza Walla Walla Bing Bang Alama Ding Dong Duper Tuesday. 24 primaries crammed into one day. So even though the day itself is the results we get from super awesome fragile list to Palooza, walla walla bing bang alama ding dong duper tuesday could tell us the names of the permanent nominees and depending on how you perceive them uh, it might be hillary clinton or barack obama or mitt romney or john mcclain john mccain ralph nader by the way hasn't announced yet whether he's going to run he wants to see which republican he'll be helping to win before he decides in other news, Los Angeles is trying out a marijuana vending machine for legal medical marijuana users. And in Germany, they're trying out a canned cheeseburger. The markets for these two products have not found each other yet, but give them time. Okay, boys and girls, it's time to answer one of your news questions. This week it comes from Will in Kansas City, Missouri. Hi, Will. Will writes, Dear Uncle Jay, my mom says that Congress only really does anything during even-numbered years when they're up for re-election. And my teacher said the same thing. Is that true? Thanks, Will. Well, you know, that's really not fair because Congress pretty much every year doesn't do anything. But in even-numbered years, they start doing things and then they blame the other party for stopping them. Things like uh, flag burning, Pledge of Allegiance. You'll be seeing that stuff again this year. They nickname that legislation the Bucket List. Don't forget, you can see more news questions and answers at Uncle Jay's website. Send your questions to Uncle Jay at UncleJayExplains.com. Check back every Monday when Uncle Jay explains the news. And remember, a good kid is good news. <laughs> <laughs>